Okay, I decided to play a bit of a newer game. I know the last two games I played was 2016, that being No Man's Sky and what's the name of the other one? Far Cry Primal. Oh, music. Anyway, I'm gonna play this game. I mean, No Man's Sky is pretty new because, well, not new. Uh, and an update, update to keep coming out. But anyway, back to the game. Normal or hardcore? Normal. Cinematics. This is one long intro. Well, husband, how goes it? Good. I should get it finished today. Where on earth is Henry? I need him to run some errands. He was still sleeping when I went out. At this hour? Blue blooded idol. Well, go and get the lazy bones up then. <laughs> Quick clout round the ear should do it. Mm -hmm. Henry, get up now. There's work to be done. Smack him. Get up or I'll come get you up, Slugabeg. Hear that? You'd better not vex him. Now get up quick. The breakfast is on the table. Wait, what's this? Have you been... Oh, Henry. How many times have I told you about fighting? Oh, it's nothing. It's just a scratch. You've been at that sword play again, haven't you? You better pray your father doesn't get to hear of it. You know how he feels about it. Oh, don't worry, it wasn't that. I, I just scratched myself is all. Mm, well, just don't come crying to me if you really do get hurt. Now get up, you rogue. Mm. Oh. <sighs> okay, can I finally play? That was long. Five minutes, probably. 
Oh, loading screen. Of course. A fine state you're in this Oh night. my god. What on earth did you get up to last night? Can I play, please? <laughs> what? What? Mm, nothing much. Oh, it's a weird boss. Some wayfarers stopped by. He was telling us what's going on in the world, and um, well, I uh, I lost track of time. And we look well, so I weird. Hope you didn't fill your head with nonsense. Well, I've got a feeling there's something you're not telling me, and it's connected with that scratch on your hand, and that suspicious-looking character with a sword who turned up in town recently. Oh, um. Why would I be? Okay, so what I want to be? <laughs> Vitality, I get it. <laughs> wink, wink. Um, what do you want to be? Agility. Vitality, strength. Uh, I I actually prefer fast moving. Then I get speed show. Hmm. What I do? Agility then. Let's go. Matt Chaz was teaching me archery. I do want vitality. Agility! Okay, fine. No. It's just. Matthias was teaching me archery. Archery? Do you want to become a poacher? Have you any idea of the punishment for that? And where did you get a bow anyway? Oh, come on. I've no interest in poaching. It's just a bit of fun. Christ, give me strength. Just don't do anything stupid. For the love of God. Promise. I promise. Okay, um... Oh, I, only, I thought he said two options. Um... You need help. If you need me to do anything, man. Ah, you're a good lad, but I'm fine. It's your. Oh, it's my personality. Okay. Okay. okay um. Is father angry with me for sleeping late? He's not happy. Yesterday, you promised him you'd help finish that sword for Saratsik. He's not as young as he was, and you know how his joints pain him. He's too proud to complain, but he needs your help, Henry. I know. Don't worry, Ma. Of course I'll help him. Good. He always says his knees ache when there's a storm coming. I hope they're wrong this time. It's looking like such a nice day. Um, this would be a douchey <laughs> response, so I'm just going to end the dialogue. Oops. I can finally move. I appreciate all the cinematics and all, but let me play. It's a game, not a movie. Oh, it's my frames. My frames pretty good. 106 FPS. I'll adjust it if ever. Um, looks decent. Looks pretty good, actually. But well, Henry looks weird. <laughs> I think it's his brow. Um... Can I pick anything? My senses say I can pick something. And they're right. So what does that do? Nothing. Oh, I see a bar. Is that a food bar? Is this like a survive game? Like I I saw a promotion of this game last year. And this is just a game I got paid for for an artwork I made. So yeah, that's what I'm playing. <laughs> Go to father. The compass will tell you where to go in case you're pursuing. Just head for the active objective waypoint. Um, is that the A? Yeah, A. Let's say F though. Or B? So E? Run. Oh! It's here. I'm a passive. Hello, father. At least you're up. That's a start. Anyway, we have a lot of work to do today. I'm finishing the sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? I'm running out of charcoal. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal burner. I'll need some money then. Yeah, that's the other thing. 
Kunesh still owes me for an axe, a hammer, and the nails I sold him a month ago. Not to mention his debt from before. Go and tell him to pay up, at least for the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. Kunesh? That drunkard? <laughs> That'll be fun. We're well, gonna go you're fight? a big lad now. I'm sure you can manage. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself and personally use that hammer to bang those nails into his arse. Sure I'll be happy to hear it. Is that all? Not quite. The Chamberlain at the castle has the cross guard for Sir Radzik's sword, which I had engraved in Sasso. You want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. <laughs> Stop off at the tavern on your way home. I know you'll be going there anyway to see that girl of yours. But make sure the ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Her name is Bianca. Right, so make sure Bianca draws me a nice cool one. Run along now, work won't wait. Uh, okay, that's a lot of errands. I remember this game being time limit, so I need to go there for a second. Buy a bag of charcoal. Ah, went out. You can find all information, the quest in the log. So, J for the quest. Come on, <laughs> I'm reading. Uh, okay, so get rejected by a bag of charcoal. That's first, right? And then at least they're marked. <clears throat> first, we go and buy charcoal. Then, so I'll be a this way. Uh, did that damage me? <laughs> it's a small jump. Oh. Okay. Okay, so yellow bar below is stamina. Where am I going? So just follow the AA. Turn this way. God be with you, Henry. I'm Henry. What? What's happening to me? Everything's blurry. Am I tired? Oh, I'm tired. <laughs> okay. Oh. Is it charcoal? Ah, uh, here. Can you not see I'm busy with Master Fate by here? If it's charcoal you want, lad, go and talk to my Alpa. Okay, talk to your Alpa. Are you the Alpa? God be with you. All right, just give me charcoal. In shops, you first have to put your purchases into your basket, and then either confirm the purchase X or try to haggle. Oh. Mm, I'm gonna try to haggle. The amount you have to pay is always shown at the top of the screen. Let's talk trade. So, oops. How do you put this in the bag? Add to basket E. I think I only need one. I think. Uh, I'm not sure. Actually, <laughs> let me check my log. How much do I need? Oh, 10, 10, 10 charcoal. Alright, yeah. Okay, let's talk trade. Come on. Okay, get 10. Whoops, one more. And then, how do you haggle? Check basket. And then I haggle. You know. <laughs> Alright, I am stupid. I have to go and. I have to go and get money from the guy first. What's his name? So, collected that from Kunesh, so he's a guy in C. Okay, there. And this, this game's realistic. <laughs> Hopefully it's in a good way. Too realistic is not good sometimes. Ah. God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? Father sent me for Father money. Father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer and nails. I've got nothing. Clear off. Pay for the tools. You know you owe father for a lot more than just the axe and hammer. If he went to the bailiff about it, you'd be in deep water. At least pay for the tools if you can't pay for everything. I told you I have no coin, you bastard. Get the hell out of here, or I'll use the axe on you. Okay. Um, let's read this long script. 
Sometimes you need powers of persuasion to achieve your goals. So when talking to people, you can often choose what kind of impression you want to make on them. You can simply use speech, which, however, is influenced by the, pre the reputation you have at the moment with the person you're talking to. Um, this hard thing. In the Middle Ages, social status was paramount. So the quality of your attire and how well-groomed you are, together with your... You are. Oh, wait. Together with your reputation can make a big difference to how people respond to you. If you look dangerous, people will be afraid to cross you and will also be more willing to assign risky tasks to you. That's influenced mainly by your strength and the deterrent effect of your weapons and equipment. But other things are also taken into account, such as blood stains on your clothes. You can sometimes rely on money to do the talking for you. You just have to agree on a persuasive sum. Bribing people works in the same way as shopping. See trade and haggling. In special cases, you can try another, any other skill, e.g. horsemanship. It's not the only manner of persuasion that's important, but also the specific offer. Because sometimes it's not enough just to choose according to your highest characteristics. You have to really read what you're going to say. All right. But different approaches work on different people. You won't intimidate a tough, t a tough bra brawler is easily, and no matter how well you dress, you won't impress the nobility easily. That's because Henry's abilities aren't simply assigned a universal value. But compared with the abilities of his counterpart, you can see the value of the various abilities in the game under the corresponding icons. You can always see your own abilities. Your counterpart's abilities are visible to you if it's someone you know well, or if you're skilled at reading people. Learn the perk empathetic. Oh, it's a perk. Your money, the amount of you have to pay. It's not just about sets, so the outcome is influenced by other factors, e.g., your reputation, whether you're dirty or bleeding, etc. If you can outdo the nimble tongue of a merchant, for example, you may want to poison him a little first and then he will be <laughs> easier to per se. Right? Or if you lead a guard away from his friends, he'll be easier to scare. Okay, so I, I choose agility, so I'm not sure how I'm gonna use it then. So, okay, speech, charisma, and strength. So, uh, in this case, agility is nothing. Deliver of your reputation is this 27 with your counterpart in regard. Oh, it's, is it down below? Right then. My reputation with them is pretty good. Um, let's try. Look, I know things aren't easy. Your wife ran off, booze is dear these days, and you're as much use as a square wheel. It's no wonder you're short of coin. But a debt's a debt. I can't leave here without something. You son of a whore. How dare you speak to me <laughs> like that? Didn't your thieving father teach you any manners? No? Well, I'll teach you then. Take care. Oh, I have to fight. <laughs> uh, Hook strong. Okay, and try. I, w I want to learn properly first, so... Bear with me. Jab is left. So jab is a weak one, right? Yeah. Kick is F. Tab is uh, locking. Shift was unlock. Q to block. Okay, health is a purple. Uh, the indicator shows roughly how much health your opponent has left. The more wounded he is, the slower he'll attack and react. When the end is near, he may either f try to flee or surrender. Your wounds. Uh, is that I can tell notify when you're bleeding when it of if you're bleeding stamina is that if an opponent strike hits your armor on your rocket will cost you stamina when your stamina is completely depleted you won't be able to defend yourself and will be wounded attacking will also deplete your stamina especially when wielding a heavy weapon health if you cover yourself badly and your armor is weak Strikes will wound you. Heavy wounds will le lead to bleeding, and bleeding will lead to death. The more your health is depleted, the lower your maximum stamina. Alright. Alright then. Ya bitch! Ah, wait. Missed. 
gut, aber fix. Okay. Ja. How do you block? Oh. Uh, do I just... Well landed. <laughs> or do I just hold it? Um, I don't know. Oh, How does he keep doing that? Okay. How do you how do you grab? Okay. Get off me! How the hell does he keep grabbing me? I wanna grab too. How do you grab? Your wife's a whore! Okay. Dying. I should have taken strength, Kevin. Ow. Oh dear, did not. You asked for it. Why the hell? <laughs> I'll have to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. Uh, am I supposed to lose that? Man, it sucks. I hate it when I lose, especially to a cunt like that guy. Wait, where's my mother? It's my mama. I should have taken strength. I hate this. Uh, I can see your health in the red bar in the lower edge of screen. Damn it. <laughs> okay, so. <sighs> you know what? I'm gonna go steal. Since I. Since I have agility, I'm supposed to be fast. Hopefully. So. I can steal them, right? Let's see. So I'm guessing this is the axe. Steal it. It's mine now. Then where is the nail? Oh, I guess we'll be a thief. I've been playing a bit of uh, Assassin's Creed lately, so it's fine. Uh, axe and hammer and nails. So where will he keep his hammer and nails? Uh, it's inside the house. Uh oh. Okay, go around about. And then I stuff inside. Okay, it doesn't even care anyway. Okay, and then I lockpick this. Oh no, okay, never mind. Okay, and then, and then there should be a hammer somewhere here. Hmm, a locked chest. I'll need a lockpick to get into that. Okay, then Fritz I'll... might have one. Fritz. So, who's Fritz? I don't even know who Fritz is. Ah, uh, you know what? I should have gone to the sword fighting lesson. <laughs> uh, okay. 
I, just in case, I want to go and heal up. So let's go to Mama. Mama! Hey, what, what, what number is she? F. Okay. Okay, no, not number. Uh, letter. F. Okay, so just right here. Mama! Mami! Mama! Oops, I'm tired. Mami, patch me up. I got beat up. Because. <laughs> <laughs> Won't stop bleeding. Oh, now, stop squealing like a baby and show me that. What's with the pixelation? Um... There you are, good as new. You ought to learn to do that yourself. Thanks, Ma. Yeah, teach me. So I'm pretty sure you guys are gonna die later on. It's not spoiler, it's from the trailer. <laughs> um Alright, so go to Fritz. Then steal the hammer and then sell it somewhere. Uh not sure where I'm gonna sell it though. Well, this is just one one town. Uh Fritz would be the blank canvas. I can't seem to see them. Ah, uh, oof. You know what? Hey, Pip. Do you want to learn something? No, I don't think so. Thanks. Suit yourself. Maybe I can. Go to the hero. So you haven't changed your mind about learning the craft of warfare. Okay, let's learn then. Have you recovered from yesterday's great wound? That oh, was nothing. <laughs> Bloody. Except mother noticed and had a word or two to say about it. No mother's happy when a son starts to take an interest in swords. Where there's weapons, there's death. The question is, what do you want? I don't want to rot in this hole forever. I feel like I don't belong here. I want to live and see the world. The world's a dangerous place and I need to know how to protect myself. Spoken like a man. And as it happens, today's your last chance. I have to leave. So, are you ready to get stuck in? Let's go. I should have yes. done this first. <laughs> All right. I wait on the ground by the sheepfold as usual. All right. Uh, sheepfold, sheepfold. Oh, there, there's a sheepfold. Here, right? Uh, walk a little faster, please. Come on. Faster. If there's gonna be stealth kills in this game, agility is worth it. But if not, I should have gone with strength. So far, oh, okay. So you do here, All right? So, can we get started? We can. Good. And since today is the last time we'll be seeing each other, you can show me everything I've told you so far. I have no idea. Okay, what do we do? Oops. Very well. Let's start with the basics. Keep moving. Your life depends on it. Okay, uh, you can move around him using A and D. E. You can lock away from your opponent and by shooting left ship. Okay. Alright, alright. Now try to hit me. You have to put your weight into your attack. If you just fiddle around, you'll get nowhere. Try slashing from different sides. Unpredictability is the key. Oh, okay, that's the the point of the things. Okay. Once again. All right. Okay. Fine. Ah, I see. The point of the blade is for stabbing. Tried a few times. Okay, stab is okay. Very good. 
Weak attacks tend to be faster and more precise at the cause of force. Stabs can be aimed at the face or at the body. Okay. Good, good. Let's try something else. One strike, I can fend off without a sweat. But if you chain your strikes, I'll have a much harder time. As soon as you land one blow, follow it with another. Alright. Try to press is your at the very moment a previous strike lands. Okay. Very good. Oh, I should have learned this first so I could have beat up the drunk card. to work and work and the main thing is to use what you've learned in real combat there's nothing better than experience believe me hopefully there's daggers I prefer swift weapons it's always been that way even back in the days when I used to play Ragnarok <laughs> I know it's not the same game but Henry I'm glad you came why Oh, you want to gamble now? Red button, <clears throat> so, where the hell is Fit? Fit? Fitz? Fitz? Huh? Ah, where am I supposed to go? Uh, buy a bag of charcoal. I'm not gonna be able to do that. Damn. Not gonna be able to buy ale too. I don't have any money. Um, man. Okay, so where is Fitz? Is this Fitz? No. Oh. Oof. And a big oof. Let me try and talk to the drunk guy again. Uh, I have to Henry, eat something. I'm glad you stopped by. My insides are shriveled up with the hunger. Are you hungry? Okay. Uh. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, uh, trader. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna talk to my father. And then see what he says. Cause I got beat up. And he was saying something about if he doesn't get his ass or whatever. Uh, okay. I got beat up. Help me. Give me some sword. About the things you wanted. Yeah, about time. Have you got everything I wanted? When I asked Kunish to pay, he fought me instead. Bastard. You don't look too bad, though. Did you get the better of him? No. Oh, fine, but he didn't give me the money. Nah, it doesn't matter. I'll sort him out this evening. I've no time for him now. Yeah, give me my money. But without Kunish's money, I can't buy those other things you wanted. Here's coin for the charcoal and the ale. I'll get it back from that mongrel this evening. Ah, uh, okay. That was the right choice. So basically, this game is realistic, extremely. So, <laughs> gonna think like this is the real world, <laughs> not the usual gameplay mechanics of most RPGs. All right, with the money, I can finally buy some charcoal from you. Let's try haggling though, so I get some extra cash back. And I needed ten, right? Except that. And then check the basket and then you can haggle. Can we do something about the price? Sure, why not? Right. Okay, so haggling works both ways whether you want to buy cheap or sell dear. You select the amount you want to pay or get WNS and confirm with E. The trader will then respond to your offer. 
If the answer is a refusal, he or she will make a counter offer and wait for your response. Does this cost me any reputation? If the slider can't be moved in one direction or the other, it means either you are or the trader does not have enough money. Dragging out the haggling with one offer after another will gradually try the trader's patience and eventually they'll drop the haggling completely. You can see how close you're getting to the point from the trader icon below the bar. The more gold there is in the background, the closer the trader is to dropping the haggling. Every unsuccessful bout of haggling lowers your reputation with the trader. Alright then. So... So this is not pay, right? How about we go for four? One gold coin, right? How about that? We agreed? That's one coin. You won't convince me with that. Oh, too, too much. So how about we meet halfway? Or more than halfway, 4.4. How about this? Or <laughs> never mind, he's, he's mad. But okay, at least we get something back. Very well, I agree. Thank you. I like this haggling. Uh, one thing I missed from Morrowind, which didn't exist in Skyrim, was haggling. Oh, cutscene again. Had to. He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Gutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts, traitors. Now even the Pope. Stop be with you, Henry. I'm with you, Matthew. So What's going on here? Deutsches Stalin shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the empire. <laughs> Who do I care about the Austrians? And nowadays, not even the devil himself can keep up with all the popes. Which is the right for pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true, though. Wenceslas is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Ratzig is Winslow's commander in chief. He stayed. This. He would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. South Bohemia is with Sigismund. And don't and forget about Gutenberg, where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but Goodman Deutsch. This is pointless. What? Some things. My words exactly. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson. Doesn't he, Fritz? Too well, Matthew. Should give him a proper hiding. Are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better Oh, that's idea. Fritz. Deutsch was talking such shit, it made me think of that huge pile of manure. You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? Count me in. Well, I'd rather torch it, to be honest. But, throwing some tears will do. <laughs> what do you say, Henry? But I was going to get ale for her father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Sir Ratzig's sword. Come on. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. So, how? Are you with us? How? Who's that? I won't, <laughs> I won't do it. <laughs> nah, I need to no, be a good I son. I want to teach the Deutsch a lesson, but... We really don't have time. Well, that's disappointing. Still, we can manage without you. Let's go, lads. Honestly, hell. How could you pass a good chance like this? I'll do it next time. Uh, hungry. Uh, you just ate the cheese earlier. 
Alright, so there were some alt tabs, randomly alt tab from earlier with the cutscene. It's probably gonna be cut some sounds on that. Sorry about that. I don't know what's happening <laughs> with my computer, but sometimes it does that. Alt tabs. Where was I going? And D. Let's pick up the castle and then buy ale from my girlfriend. Okay, then. Excuse me. Sorry. Hey. The castle is near my place. Okay, then. I'll be with you. I'm with you, Henry. How are you? <laughs> what, what if I no, just just do my business <laughs> father sent me we're forging a sword for Saratic and the Chamberlain has the cross guard and pommel father had them engraved in Sassau right they're here the Chamberlain gave them to us for you we looked them over beautiful work I've never seen anything so fine I can't wait to see the sword just make sure you don't botch it and did I ever botch anything where shall I start Ah, shut up and give me what I want, or I'll kick your ass this evening. Right away, your lordship. Magnificent. Shame I can't keep the sword for myself. Well, I'd better go if we're to get the job done by this evening. Godspeed. See you later in the tavern. You certainly will. After today's work, the ale might even be on me. Alright, and then the ale. Can I jump here? No. So my f um, the ale should be last because he wants it cold. So if I'm gonna <laughs> keep thinking this is realistic, uh, I gotta get it last. So this is fine. That's it. All right, the tavern is this way. It's this way. It looks like a tavern sign. Where do I enter though? Here? Oh, here, okay. So, where do I get it? The, oh, you. God save, my lovely. You're looking well today. <laughs> you too, handsome. What brings you here? Should I flirt? No, I just get a ale. <laughs> what else could I expect from a village lab? <laughs> what will it be then, ragamuffin? Um, pitcher for father. For father. <laughs> a pitcher as usual. Aye, bring me a cool one from the cellar. <laughs> but of course. Thanks. It's on me today. <laughs> you can pay me back this evening. Out of the question. Here you go. And this evening I'll have something more for you. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> I wonder what that is. Wink, wink. You'll have something to look forward to this evening. <laughs> <laughs> you too. Oh, um, by the way, that shifty looking fellow was asking after you. Vanya. I suppose. He is a man who makes his coin robbing honest wayfarers. I'm sure of it. I'll be happy when he's gone for good. But what in heaven's name are you up to with him? He promised to teach me how to use a sword. What use would that be to you? Enough. You sound just like father. I'll be going now. See you this evening. Hal, I've got something special for you. Is that so? Now what would that be? Your favorite. Save your schnapps. Okay. You're an angel. <laughs> yeah, I keep saying you're hungry. You bet I will. Yeah, wonder what tank is. <laughs> we all know what that is. Something to do with the bed. Save your schnapps. The game saves automatically at important moments during quest. Oh, it's not food. And when you sleep in your own bed, to save it. Me. <laughs> okay then. 
Oh, I get it. Save your snaps. Ooh. Wordplay. Alright, uh, here's your ale, father. I am honoring your last days to live, so I'm doing a good job as a son. Here. About time. Have you got everything I wanted? Yep. I have charcoal, the hilt, and the ale. We can start. Good job. Let's have it then, son. Well done. Right. Let's see what kind of job the master and Sasal did for us. Look at that lad. That's what I call craftsmanship. What does the inscription mean? Damn the vino. Doesn't look like Czech to me. Latin, maybe? Lord Radzig ordered it. This will be the finest sword I've ever made. Have we got the charcoal? Good. And fire up the forge. I'll put it all together. By the way, I heard some gossip about what happened to Deutsch. I expect you know something about it. Maybe. Maybe? Someone threw dung at Deutsch's freshly lime-washed house, maybe? And maybe those cronies of yours had something to do with it. That Deutsch was talking treason in the tavern about Sigismund and the King. Got what he deserved. Got what he deserved, did he? He didn't even participate. <laughs> Look, I don't know if you're mixed up in this or if it's just those friends of yours. It's all the same to me. But I have a trade to run. The German pays well. And having my son in the pillory helps nothing and nobody. Least of all the King. You understand? Yes. Look me in the eye, Henry. Do you understand? I understand. Good. Then we'll never have this conversation again. So you think it's right to let traitors speak ill of the king? Does that boy ever listen to a word I say? So Deutsch spouts me. So what? You might win a fight with violence, but you'll never win an argument. Remember, Henry, if you want to convince someone that they're wrong, try using your mouth, not your fists. I'll use my agility, because that's what I chose. The furnace is ready. Right, we'll do the grip. I'll heat it up, and when I take it out, you slip the grip on so it fits exactly. You know what you're doing. Do it. Good. Once more. I'm pretty sure. Done. Oh. Now file it down so it sits well in the hand. I'll prepare the guard. Father, why did you leave Prague? Who ever heard of a master swordsmith making horseshoes in a village? <laughs> I have my reasons, Hal. And here I have your mother and you. Why would I want any other life? Do you remember Emperor Charles? I do. Life was good under his reign. Better than now. He built half of Prague, a score of castles, had a bridge made over the Moldau, and founded a university. And all without a war. He knew how to rule. Better than Wenceslas. Better by far. But Wenceslas doesn't have it easy. It's hard to step into the shoes of someone whose like is born only once a thousand years. What about Sigismund? Do you think Charles would have brought an army down on his own people like Sigismund? No. 
Wenceslas may not be the equal of his father, but Sigismund, he brings shame to the royal name. How's it going? Give it here, and we'll put it all together. Magnificent. Indeed it is. The Lord be with you. My father sent me for those nails. Good day to you, Teresa. They're ready. Will you fetch them for me, Hal? They're in the trunk in the living room. <laughs> okay. That's a lot of uh, more cutscenes. <laughs> okay. It's in here. This is just a bunch of cutscenes for this first video. <laughs> I guess that's inside, right? Open it. I need some apple. I'm hungry. Do I eat it? How do you eat it? Oh, I'm just picking it up. I'm not eating it. Okay, how do you eat it? Um. How do, I, how do I eat? Oh, okay. So, I guess that's why you're hungry. Um, nom nom. <laughs> that gave me nothing. Uh, okay. So, where's the nails? You said it's inside here, right? What did he say? Where's the nails? Here? Oh, it's here. Okay. Uh, tickle. Ah! Oops. <laughs> I took everything. Here are those nails you wanted. Thanks. So, how's Bianca? Um, she's fine. Why do you ask? Just wondering. Will you be going to the dance this evening? We will. Maybe <gasps> we'll see each other there. Anyway, mustn't keep you. I'll be on my way. That soil is truly beautiful. Hey! Fine lass, eh? Now stop staring at her and come and see this. It's time for the trial by fire. <laughs> we did a fine job. I would expect nothing less from such a renowned swordsmith. Well, those days are gone, sir. Hmm. But you haven't lost your skills, though. Would you like to try it? Sir, what good is a sword to a commoner? Let try it. Yeah, let me try it. <laughs> Still have a lot to learn. Ask your father to show you how. He knows what he's about. Learning his trade will serve him better in life, sir. Perhaps. But who knows what the future holds for each of us? I see that you almost have it finished. It just needs a polish, then Henry will bring it to you. Excellent. Fine work, very fine. A sword such as this will bring honor to its bearer. What say you say, Svan? True, Sir Radzik. If I'd have had its like back in Nicopolis, things would have worked out differently. How odd to find such an accomplished swordsmith working in a place like this. A man of his talent would have no problem making a fortune in Prague or Vienna. 
You're right. It's a very long and peculiar story. I'd be glad to listen to it over a cup of wine, but duty calls and I must leave. Here you are. Learn from your father. He truly is a master of his craft. I'm sure our paths will cross again. He certainly will. Once it's ready, send your son up to me with it. Good work, Martin. Sure. It's been an honor, say, Have a safe journey to Sasa. The honor is mine, Sir Radzik. Thank you for the hospitality. A long, peculiar history. That was a long time ago. I might tell you about it sometime, but not today. Will you teach me how to use it, like Sir Radzik said? Why? Well, it could come in useful. Maybe I'll travel a bit before settling down. I'd like to know more than the tavern on the green in the forge. You know the trouble with an adventurous life, son? It can end before it gets started. I might teach you how to handle a sword, and then someone will shoot you with a crossbow as soon as you set foot outside the house. You talk as if you've seen it happen. A man my age has seen a lot. Being a blacksmith might bring no glory, but it has its benefits, like keeping your head on your shoulders. I want to end my days in Scalitz, here, beneath the linden tree, and by your mother's side. Well, so do I, one day. But first, I'd like to see the world, meet new people. Meet them, or beat them. Meet. You have to keep going on about it. Then you've no need to learn swordplay. A messenger. He was in a hurry. What's happened? Ooh. Your mother is in the village. I'll fetch her and follow right behind. I'll go with you. No. You do what I say right now. Give the sword to Sir Radzik. If anything happens, he'll take care of you. He owes me.
Alright, so that was a lot of uh, cutscene. I'm gonna leave for now. I'm gonna end this video right here. Oh my gosh. Or not. Oh crap. What the heck? I'm <laughs> uh, gonna run first. I just <laughs> I tried to fight. <clears throat> uh, this is what you get for a level one trying to fight a level sixty. So I'm not gonna end the video yet. I'm gonna try to escape first. <laughs> I think I'm safe here. All right. Okay. Oh, I can pick this up. Okay, I'll end the video right there. Save the game first. Save it. Okay. And yeah, that was a whole bunch of cinematics. I didn't expect that to have so much cinematics. I think I only played 20 minutes, and then the rest of the 40 minutes was cut cutscenes. <laughs> anyway, see ya. Thank you.